Yeah, definitely. And and, and you know, JL3 struggled with a team that also had some size issues in, in Heat Lightning. Oh, turnover there. Here comes Wesley Yates with the basketball. He really turned it on in that second half against Heat Lightning yesterday. Missed it there. Follow, no good. It's a battle underneath. A lot of contact, and it looks like we have free throws coming up for Mashai the big Hill. fella, Mashai Hill. He is a bruiser. I think there's something to be said about these guys, you know, kind of knowing the competition now, knowing it's another Texas team. Mm -hmm. I don't think we'll see that same lull. Yeah, I, I, I would agree. I don't think it's gonna, they're going to allow things to happen quite as easily as they did when Heat Lightning were playing them. But then again, JL3 did turn it on when they needed to. That Heat Lightning team did make a statement in that, you know, statement losses aren't common, but I think that was one. Showing what they can do. Shot up no good there. Rebound secured, and here comes... Texas impact in the hands of Evan Phelps, the point guard. See what he's got. Phelps hands it off. Give it to everyone. Now up there it's Knuckles. Guy you, you mentioned to watch out for. Hounding defense there from Wesley Yates. He's called for the reach in. Wait's got a good late uh, Yates got it going late yesterday. Mm -hmm. Um Kind of struggled in his first uh, first two games out for his own standards. I think he's just going to get more comfortable. Said he wants to get more comfortable passing and playing defense and mm -hmm. help defense. Definitely. I'm impressed by this matchup right now. We got Zayden High going on Garrett Knuckles, who's perimeter player, pretty versatile. And Zayden High, 6'10". Yep. Lengthy. Range. Here comes Johnson. Jail three pushing with pace. Yates three, no. Couldn't get that one to fall. Here comes... Phelps here for impact. Stepped out on the sideline. It was Knuckles. Now we'll see what they're able to do. JL3 up one to nothing. Just over a minute into this one. You know, and I don't, I don't think they would have been pleased with their own performances yesterday, so I really expect to see a different showing today. And mm -hmm. Right on time. Wesley Yates from the corner. Getting it done. That's what he does. Missed his first couple, but able to get the rest of that one to go. Step back three for the answer, no. Rebound secured. Here's Impact trying to get something going. Phelps will drive baseline. Kick it out to no man's land, but it's recovered. Corner three, Knuckles. Can he make it? Yes. Answer right back. It's four to three. And that's what he does. Texas Big Impact. Big time shot maker. Definitely not just a shot maker, but definitely what JL3 has to account for. Here's I'm, Cole I'm excited in the to corner. see. Yeah, Cole. High. Cole kicked a high, and I found another three. This kid is outrageous. Um, he's a I'm really excited talent. to see Jacob Cole because he really hasn't he hasn't stood out yet for uh, for JL3, and it's hard to when you got so much talent on the team. Yeah, but, you know, he's it, top 50 of crew himself. And, and and the thing that he's been doing that has been translating is his effort on the glass. That's probably been the biggest yep. boost that he's given his team so far. But you know, we know with talented teams that it's going to take a little while for them. <laughs> Excuse me to Joe. I should have turned myself down there. Apologies to the audience. Appreciate it. 7-3 lead for JL3. That one is off the foot of High. They're going to call a kick. Yeah, and if High comes out here and has a solid game today, there's a real chance he takes home the uh, MVP award from this yeah. tournament because his first two games were terrific. Yeah, he, is, he has been superb 19 so and 13, 17 and 7, shooting 65% from the floor, 50% yeah, from three. You know, Averaging 18 and 10, uh, that that is a good start to, to your spring and summer. Here is Texas Impact trying to get into their offense. They have 15 on the shot clock to work with. Here's Eberwine. Eberwine, excuse me. Pull up jumper is up. No good. Missed it short. Offensive rebound. Got the put back. Now we'll see what Chris Johnson can do. Playing more point guard than we're used to seeing him. Yates is fouled on the shot.
Got a jersey switch there. Kalen Way is wearing zero and he's not wearing 11. Mm. Got that updated now. Thank you. Yates, I guess they're getting stuff organized. I don't know how many free throws he's taken. That one is good. Yates able to connect on one of three. Uncharacteristic two misses from the line there for him. Here's Texas Impact. Down eight to five. Going back and forth here early. See what they can get. Five minutes to play first quarter. Strong drive kick. Going into the lane. Lay up. No. And it's a foul. And it will be Garrett Knuckles going to the line for two. Six three guard from Bullard High School. Really impressive build for a pros you know, for a shooting guard. Mm -hmm. Gets good lift on his jump shot. See if he can knock this one down. It is up and good. Is impact based out of um, Dallas? Based out of Dallas, yep. An Under Armour contract last year. First year, last year? Last year, yep. And they, uh, I believe so. It could be wrong. It could be two years ago. But I know they had a really strong team last year. They had Robert Jennings going to Texas A&M. Mm -hmm. um, they had a really strong team top to bottom. Here is JL3. Pitch across pass from Walters in the middle of the floor. Cole, good shot fake there, finds Johnson. Johnson weaving through, trying to figure out what to do with it. Had it ripped away. Here comes Knuckles. Might get it right back on the trail. Ooh, oh, he jumped. Travel. Yeah. I don't think he anticipated Cole getting back there like that. But he'll end up leaving his feet. And now JL3, up by one, has a chance to add to their lead. Across the court. See what we get. It's Walters with it. One of the shiftiest guards we've seen here all weekend. He'll go around a screen from high. He'll attack. Give it down to high in the middle of the floor. High working down low. Goes up and one. Zayden high. Sounds about right. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. He can pick and pop. Got it in that little short roll there with Walters. One power dribble through the contact. Let me get a bucket plus the foul. We'll see what he does at the line here. Trying to put JL3 up by four if he hits it. And he does. Nothing but net. 11-7 the count. Inbound here. A little pressure look from JL3. I don't know if they're going to try to turn him over, but more so just make him work it up the court. There's a trap. Almost got away with the travel. Down low. Reverse layup. Trying to dunk it in, but almost had it blocked. I think High got a piece of it. He made it all the way back. Here comes Cole to Walters. Walters, nice move. Drive and kick. Extra pass. Working around. High probably should have shot it. Now it's a turnover. No, it's not. Cole tracks right, it down. Right. He falls on it. And he calls a timeout. He should have shot it. You're completely right. Yep. I'm always a fan of the extra pass, but when you're shooting 60% from three, yeah. you're going to let it fly. Absolutely. What a job from Zayden High so far. 11-7 lead, like we said. 3-30 Five to go. He impacts the game in so many ways. He's got a block, swing pass, rebounding, hitting threes. Yep. They filter everything through him, it's looking like, and that's a smart idea. Especially when we got such talented guys on the on the perimeter. Mm-hmm. Strong drive there. Knocked away. Will stay with JL3. Still got plenty of time on that shot clock. Substitutions coming in. Get it into Walters. Let's 
Let's see what Walters does. Drive. It's fouled. Right there. Blocking foul is the call, I believe. That was Shea Eberwine. High. Another three. It's up. And good. Zayden High again from deep. Absolutely unconscious. My goodness, what a shot. 14-7 the count. Three and change to go here in this first quarter. Drive from Phelps. Scoop layup. That's tough. Couldn't get it. Tip in. No. Third try. No. It's batted around. Texas Impact mixing some gimmies. A lot of contact and a foul is called. And it looks like number 20, Ryland Kennedy, the 6'5 forward, is going to go to the line for two right here. That one is no good. That one is good as well. And that one is good, not as well, excuse me. First one was no good. Here comes Walters with the basketball kind of running the show here. So many different lineups that this JL3 team can throw at you with the pieces that they have. Here's Cole with it. Cole being shut down a little bit there by Knuckles. A little in and out move, floater up. Couldn't get the bank. Rebound secured by impact. Here comes Knuckles. Gets it to the corner. Phelps, one dribble, squares up, lets it fly off the back iron. No. Rebound secured underneath. Try to get it. Knuckles has it. Gets rid of it over to Phelps. Phelps drives baseline. Scoop layup underneath. Blocked away by Cole. Cole doing a great job. 6-7 wing. Kind of doing a little bit of everything right now. See what he gets. Around a screen. He'll attack. Straight downhill. Cole all the way. He's fouled. He'll go to the line for two. And it looks like he rolled his ankle a little bit. See if Cole is all right. He is going to limp off. Trainer is over there. Luckily, he's able to put some weight on that foot. But he is definitely not doing so hot right now. And it looks like Yates is going to come in to shoot the free throws for him. Wesley Yates to try to give his team a seven point lead at the line. I think he's one for three from there on the day. First one is up and good. Wesley Yates, 15 8, lead for JL3. Here comes Texas Impact. Shot is up, no good. Going the other way with it. Shot up, Flowers. Yes, or not, Flowers. Walters, no. Here comes 
Yates, shot up, no. Here comes Texas Impact, trying to get it going. Floater up, no. Rebound, battled around, going the other way. Impact, what are they going to do? Inbound right there to Black. He'll go up. Foul is called. He'll go to the line for two. That one is good right there from Donovan Black. 18-11 the count. Zayden High gets a break. One more free throw for Donovan. 6-6 six, six forward. It is up and good. Knocks it down. 18-12 the count. Two possession game. What can Trenton Walters get? Two-man game. What's he going to do? Gives it to Yates. Yates rifles a pass in the middle of the floor. Goes up strong. No underneath. Rebound secured by Impact. Here they come. 45 seconds left to go. Strong drive. Oh my goodness. What a block right there from Mashai Hill. Throw it up to Yates. Reverse no. Rebound going the other way. Here comes Phelps. Phelps goes up strong. Blocked away. Mashai Hill again. Yep. And it is going with JL3. Shot up there from the corner, no. Rebound. Rejected away. Actually, it's a foul call. Yates will go to the line for two. That is good. 19-12 the count. That one is good as well for Yates. Stolen away. Push ahead. Yates has to fire it. He does at the horn. It is up. No good. At the end of the first quarter, it is 20 to 12, JL3 in front of Texas Impact. Be back with you guys in just a moment. Second quarter about to get underway. has been a pretty good contest here so far between JL3 and Texas Impact. A couple mistakes on either side, but Alec, again, if, I don't know if you have a moment to talk, but it's been yeah, it's been a lot of Zayden High, man. Yeah, Zayden High has been great. Two threes already. And one has nine points. Sheesh. Uh, he had four rebounds, too, a couple blocks. I mean, he just looks so comfortable out there. Mm-hmm. And he's such a needed piece for them because he's their one, you know, skilled big man. Yeah, exactly. Playing the four and five. Has a very versatile skill set. Now we'll see what they're able to do here.
Action back underway. It's Walters. Round a screen from Hill. Gives it over to the corner. Chris Johnson. Why wouldn't you take that? Johnson for three. You can count it from him. 23-12. 7.30 left. Dribble handoff there. See what they get. Texas Impact trying to get it going. Pitch ahead pass Johnson. Saved, kept alive. Shot up, no. Rebound, who's got it? Going the other way, it's Chris Johnson with it. Johnson pushing the basketball. Has a defender on his hip. Finds it over, Robinson driving. Tough one, turns it over. Wrap around right there. Here comes impact. All the way it's Knuckles. Dump off pass to no man's land. Robinson finds a way. Pitch ahead Zayden High. High leading the break. Going to go up. Lost it on the way up. Rebound secured by Robinson. He'll settle it down. Give it to Walters and he'll take his time to reset. Shot is up and good. Zayden High, another three. My goodness, 26-12 lead for JL3. Texas Impact turns it over. They are having a hard time here in this stretch. Shot up there. Good. Chris Johnson. 29-12. JL3 in total control. 5.45 to go. That's what we were expecting to see yesterday. I think it just took a little bit for them to uh, Jell settle in. A little, yeah. yeah. 5.35 left. Trying to create is Texas Impact. We'll see what they can get. Five and a half left. 29-12. Total control. High gets a steal. Pitches head Robinson. He'll lead the break. Robinson. Nice pass down low. Walters. Walters taking his time with it. Gives it out to Johnson. Johnson thought about the deep one. He'll weave through out to Robinson. He thinks about it as well. Shot up high. He's going he's to go to the free throw line right here for two. Zayden High has nearly half a JL threes points. He's going to go to the line and try to get two more. Free throws missed from high. Couldn't get those to go. 29-12, still the score. Five minutes to go. Pull-up jumper. Good. Confident shot and a needed one from Braylon Smith. 29-15. That shot is up and no good from Flowers and they call a foul. Or, or uh, Walters and they call a foul. Shot is up and no good. Rebound secured. Or not rebound. No rebound there. 4.43 left. Said it's the second quarter. That one is good from Walters. Here comes Phelps. Pushing for impact. Knuckles will drive. Kind of caught in his tracks a little bit. Gives it out to Phelps. Extra pass. Good shot fake right there. 
three is up, no good. Rebound secured by Texas Impact in the hands of White. They're gonna work it around. It's Everwine drives in, blocked away by Zayden High. Second one altered by High. Third one again al altered by High. Yeah, he is oh active. My. Unbelievable, and they call the foul. They get him with the foul? Yeah, they did. <laughs> Trying to make plays, time, I guess. Yeah, he doesn't like it. <laughs> See what they get here. A little short jumper up, no good. Rebound secured. Chris Johnson. He's dealing with some pressure right now. Evades it and pitches ahead to Walters. Walters finds Zayden High. He thought about the three. Step back triple high. Oh my goodness if he hits that one. Couldn't get it to go. Pitch ahead pass here. Comes Knuckles. Knuckles in the middle of the floor. Gives it up. Strong drive and finish right there from number one, Braylon Smith. Two, two points right there for Texas Impact. 30 to 17 the score. Three takes 30. Yeah, quick timeout. We'll see what they're able to do. Figure some things out. Both teams talking things over. Right now in the timeout, we've got a big one coming up next. Drive Nation taking on Mass Rivals going to be a battle between those two teams. Very excited about that. High level talent on the floor. And then we'll have some bracket and bracket championship game after that. See so wins the Vegas berth. Here comes Walters. What's he gonna do? Looks like there's some miscommunication on the set there. Looks like Mashai Hill didn't remember the play. Kick out, Johnson for three. No good. Rebound Hill, battling for it. Underneath draws a foul. Three seventeen left in the half. Thirty to seventeen the count. Actually it's not nineteen, excuse me. Get that scoreboard corrected. Here's Johnson thinking about it. He'll drive, give it right back to Hill. Hill puts up the jumper, no good. Rebound secured by impact. Here they come. Braylon Smith finds Knuckles. Knuckles posting up. Retreats. They're gonna call a set. Yep, they're going to attack this mismatch. Pick and switch. Shot up. Good. That is exactly what Impact is looking for on that possession. Braylon Smith for three. 30 to 20. They're hanging around. Two and a half minutes left here in this first half. Walters stopped in his tracks. Kick out. Drive. Dump down. Hill lost it. Here comes Impact an important stretch for them right here I think it is big Close three half well big three couldn't get it rebound secured by Everwine Lord. he's competing and now Phelps has it they're gonna call out a set I feel like Texas Impact kind of senses that they have a little window to get back into this game right now gives it back to Phelps they got 17 on this shot clock 157 on the game clock Phelps around the screen Phelps looking to attack in that left hand gives it out Deep three, Everwine, no good. Rebound secure going the other way. All the way, layup, got it to go. 
Big time finish underneath, 32-20, JL3 up by 12. Shot up there, no good. A lot of contact, charge going the other way. Big play by Knuckles there to get his team the ball back with a minute 20 left in the half. They can keep this 10 and under. I think they have a chance to make a game of it in the second half. They got to end, end this half with some confidence. They got to go to Braylon Smith more, I think. Yeah. They've, they've given it to him late. Use it or lose it. Yep, use it or lose it. Gets uses the full. Might as well talk it over with his boys. Minute 15 left, like we said. 32 to 20 is the score. Let's see what happens. We already said we have mass rivals getting ready to take on these boys next. Minute 15 left. Both these teams trying to get things sorted out here. Trying to think of how, how I'm gonna how I'm gonna go about these March Madness games today, Alec. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do. What do we got for lines? Eight. It's down to eight now. St. Peter's. Good. Still not betting on it, but good. There you. Sheehan Holloway should want me to bet against them because I did so far twice. Well, and I've lost. Well, I'm just so. doing it again. And it's done. Let's see what they get right here. Smith. Oh, oh my goodness. Zayden High sent that way out of town. My goodness. Let's see what they can get right here. Kick out deep three at the horn of the shot clock. No. Rebound secured by JL3. Here they come. 32-20 the count. Gives it to Johnson. Johnson taking his time. We'll see what he's got. Gives it to High. Uh-oh. Zayden High down the lane draws a foul. His ability at 6'10 to attack closeouts confidently is something serious. First free throw, Zayden High. No, missing free throws today. See if he can get the second one. 41.9 on the clock. They're going to have another opportunity. He does get the second one. 33 20. Everyone gives it up. It's Kalen White. He'll take the deep three. Got it. That's a big shot right there for Texas Impact to get it back within 10. It's exactly what they needed to do. And a steal and, and a foul. One. Wow. Knuckles. That's a big swing for Texas Impact. Got a chance to make it a seven-point game right here at the line. I think Knuckles hit that 1-3 earlier. Offensively, he's been fairly quiet since, but that's a big play right there before the half. That one is no good. Rebound secured by JL3. And we're going the other way. Ten seconds, it's Walters. What's he going to do with it? Walters crosses over, gives it out. Yates weaving through traffic, trying to bully his way, able to save it. Johnson couldn't get the shot off, didn't realize he didn't have any time left. And at the end of the half, 33 Texas Impact made a nice little run. To get back with an eight. See what Knuckles does right here. Gives it up to Braylon Smith. 
Strong drive on the baseline. Knuckles in the middle of the floor. Gives it back to Eberwine. Eberwine thought about the jumper. Gives it out to Phelps. He's got 10 on the shot clock. Kick out. Eberwine thought about it. Step back. Couldn't get the space. Knuckles. Three. No. Graze the rim. Zayden high on the rebound. Here comes Chris Johnson with the basketball. Used to play with Houston Hoops last summer. Now it's a JL3. Go around the screen. Gives it out. Zayden high. Corner triple. His ability to space the floor from the front court, whether it be at the four or the five, is something serious. Zayden high with another triple, and he's feeling it. Didn't get back, though. Knuckles. Answer right back. No good. Gets his own board. Little floater up. No. Good pass, though. That was a great find to zero. Kalen White for two. 36-27. High, three, no good. Rebound, here we go the other way. Pitch ahead pass, Everwine, up, no good. Rebound secured, Zayden High. Already hit a triple to start the half. Pitch ahead layup, no, we'll actually kick it back out to Johnson. Takes some time here. Johnson, what a find to Yates. Yates takes a bump, foul is called. Six and a half minutes to go here. Checking in is Ryland Kennedy, undersized forward, kind of a bruiser type. As Alec Kinski rejoins me here, Zayden High started off the half with half with another, another triple. Another three? Yep. Oh, that is a surprise. <laughs> got 18 now. Uh, what do you 18. have? 15 at the half. Yeah. We'll set here. See what Johnson can do. Back out to High again. He thought about it. He'll drive here now. Go up. Wiped away. What a block right there from number 20, Ryland Kennedy. Pitch ahead past Knuckles. So attack the closeout, go in, lays it in for two. Zayden High just smushed a photographer on the baseline there. Really? Yeah, somebody scuffed up her shoe. Yeah, she's probably not happy with that. Nice Down pass up. by Caden Gumps. That was. Drop off pass. Gumps did a great job there. Layup, got it. Answer right back. 38, 31 the count. In the middle of the floor, Johnson tries to take a bump, put it up, no. Rebound secured by Kennedy. Kennedy's gonna push the floor. Jumper up, Knuckles, can he get it? No, miss it short, rebound Zayden High. He'll pitch ahead to Gump. What a outlet pass. That was on a line. What a find from Zayden High. 40 to 31 lead right here for JL3. Jumper up, good. That was a big time shot from Kalen White. To get it back, they call it a three. 40 to 34. Chris Johnson, little drag screen set for him by the big fellow, Mashai Hill. Turnover, Knuckles. Knuckles. Nice find again. Layup good. With the run by Texas Impact here. Braylon Smith, timeout called by. Time out, yeah, yeah, they got they got to get things together. 40 to 36 is the count. 439 to play here in the third quarter. Miles Master Cola here with Alec Kinski live from the circuit on the Hoop State Network. The jump. Circuit League session one. Very, very excited to be here winding down the action today and we have a big one coming up on the horizon for you here mass rivals adidas 3ssb team out of boston taking on drive nation the preseason number two team in the country and they have lived up to the expectations through their first pair of games this weekend so far yeah they look terrific ron holland leading the way i think uh you know if they get you know contribute consistent contributions from their bench they're going to be really really hard to beat because their starting five is as good as anyone in the country yeah we saw that last night with them kind of trying to develop the depth as we've mentioned they have a lot of different pieces at their disposal so yeah, you're completely correct we'll see what they're able to do in, in this one coming up score correction it's actually 40 to 35 called that a, one of those shots at two that was kind of on the fringes of it but regardless it's been a great run for Texas Impact See what they're able to do right here. Good 
here comes JL3. And Zayden High thought about stepping into one from way downtown. Now it's Walters. He'll take the deep three. It's up. No good. Rebound. Here we go. Smith has it. He'll work it around. Dead dribble. That's a trying to move him side to side. Zigzag him a little bit. They jump that. Yates rifles a pass. A little over ambitious with it. Went off his teammate's foot, but he'll lay it up. No. Rebound secured by Braylon Smith. Smith pitch ahead to Kennedy. Kennedy working down low. Trying to get some space. Can't really get it. He's forced to give it out. Three-pointer from the corner. Up. No good. That was off the fingertips of Smith, and now we're going the other way. It's Gums with it for JL3. Under four minutes to go now in the third quarter. Zayden High passes deflected. And it will be Walters that settles it down. Walters has a screen set by High. He'll attack. Scoop way up. Got it. Let's take. Absolutely. Alex really was bad. saying yesterday that he is really good in the ball screen situation. Yes. Hard to stay in front of. Without a doubt. 42-35 is the score. Middle of the floor here. Impact trying to get something going. It's Knuckles. Knuckles takes a bump. Has a size advantage, but he lost the basketball. Going the other way. Everwine's getting ready to come back in. Walters will bring it up. We have not seen Cole return. Don't believe he is at the end of the bench, which is a good sign, but he is not going to come back into this game. I'd be surprised if he does. That was a nice finish right there from Chris Johnson going all the way to the right. Nine point lead again for JL3. Everwine trying to find a friend to pass to. Kind of try to dribble to the corner. He gives it up to Kalen White. Now it's Evan Phelps with it. Phelps wants a ball screen. He gets one. He'll attack. Into the lane. Scoop layup rejected away by Zayden High. He is absolutely everywhere at both ends of the floor. I feel like a broken record talking about him. But we, we do, but he just keeps giving us reasons to do so. And it's it's something. He's a kid that will be, uh, I'm sure someone will be, will be getting phone calls about this week from college coaches. 44-35. I mean, not even. The film's going to pop off. Yeah. Like fly off the fly off the screen at him. It's probably going to go in. It absolutely is. That. He, I'm not even sure what to say at this point. He is in his bag. Oh my goodness. We're about to get his numbers for the weekend. I think we're all going to be surprised. I mean, Maybe he, not. I mean, he's, he's probably going to be flirting with averaging like 22 and 10 around I think that. it's more so his three-point percentage. Yeah, no, he's, he's probably going to shoot over like 55, 60% from three. Yeah. That was a bucket right there. It's down to a 10-point game. And a third. We'll check what he is from three this game. Yeah. Let's see what he has for the tournament. A lot of contact. What hustle from Gums to get all the way back. Let's see what... I mean, you got to go to Zayden High here. Yeah, you got to run something. Two-man game. I, go, I think you go pick and pop with him. And Walters. We'll see what they do. They, there it uh, is. How do you help off him? He missed oh, it. They got looked, bailed out, but how, it he's, looked good. You can't help off him. All the way down the lane. He's going to go up and try to dunk it. Chris Johnson said, Meet me uptown, my friend. Call for the foul ball. Got him a little of the body, but that was pretty. Yeah. I think, yeah, you're right. He did get him with the body, but at, at, where, at, the, at the peak of the, the peak of the mountain. Yeah. That was all clean, but we'll see. Uh, if free throws are able to be knocked down by, looks like it is Ryland Kennedy at the line for two. 122 to go, first free throw good. Zayden High will get a break. Kind of try to get that extended end of third quarter into the fourth quarter break for him, I'm sure. Is he at five threes today? Four or five? At least, go at least five, at least five. <laughs> Maybe only four, but he said at least four. Second one is no good for Kennedy. Here comes Johnson. Into the corner, it's Gums. Gums drives, kind of got stuck there, gives it out to Brody Robinson. Robinson, going to use a ball screen. He'll get to the middle. He'll find Johnson. Thought about the deep one, good shot fake. Johnson, trying to create. Has a force to give it out, and there's only 12 seconds on the shot clock. Let's see what he's got. Johnson around a screen. Has a lot of guys around him, turns it over. Got himself a little too deep there. 
Now Ryland Kennedy has it. He'll give it up to the corner. Strong drive, shot up, no. Rebound secured, Johnson. Pace is picking up. He's got Robinson in the corner. He finds him. Robinson squares up, lets it fly. You can count those every time. That is what he's out there to do. Yep. Make plays and make shots. Down low layup. Got it. Nice. That was a big finish plus the foul. Looks like that was Kalen White. He's had himself a game. Much needed basket too. Co Coach, you're all good. Don't worry about it. Coach is always like, they got me on camera, man. I can't be swearing, bro. It's, yeah. it's all good, bro. You you are tame compared to what we've been dealing with here all week. And what we deal with, I mean, we got Jeff McGinnis yeah. back home. Like, like, you know, like, it is, you're more than okay. Tame. Yeah. 50 to 40 is the count. Shot clock turned off after that missed free throw down there. And now Walters looking to look to make something happen. Kicked ball violation, 5.2 on the clock. Kind of a smaller lineup here. Floater up, tough shot, no good. That is going to do it for the third quarter. 50 go check to 40. Yeah, stats. yeah, definitely go do that. Well, Alec does that. We'll bring you guys into the fourth quarter here. It's going to be an incredible finish between these two teams. Eight minutes to go. See if we can get a March Madness update. I think we had a game start already. So Alec just gave me the word that Zayden High is five. You said what? What? What is he today? That is incredible. Here comes JL3. Three. Good. Walters got that one to go. To get the fourth quarter started. Big shot to set the tone for JL3. Now up 13. Pull up jumper. Phelps missed it short. Rebound Robinson. Robinson finds Gums. Gums back to Robinson, thought about it. Oh, one dribble pull up from three, no good. Rebound saved in the hands of Everwine. And here comes Evan Phelps. Seven oh five to go. Let's see what impact can get here. Good deflection there from Robinson, standing in the gaps. Everwine, step back three. That's a tough shot. Couldn't get it. Fifty-three forty. the count. 6.52 to go. Some substitutions coming in for both of these teams. So Alec, what's the uh, what's the Zayden High report? What's he from the game and what's he on the weekend? Uh, he's ten of seventeen for the weekend. He's five of seven for the game. Good. He's got nineteen. Good lord. Yeah. Good for fifty nine percent. Not bad. Nah, that's not bad at all. Not a <laughs> classic hashtag. Not a big deal. I'm only fifty seven percent from three on the weekend. Not a big deal. Fifty three forty the count. Here's Walters, looking to create something. A crossover, thought about the pull-up, gives it to Johnson though. And now Johnson is gonna look to make something happen. A 
lost it. Johnson trying to get it back. They got four seconds. They got to shoot it. Step back. Throws it up. Not a shot. Going the other way. Here comes Braylon Smith. Jumper up. No good, but a foul is called. Six oh seven left. Down low. I don't know who's got that. It looks like a bucket though underneath for Texas Impact. 53-42. 5.55 left. Lob it up. Well, Lay second in. jump for Jonathan Ogunfoye there was pretty impressive. I'm excited to see how he develops for them. Definitely. Pull up jumper. No good from everyone. We're going the other way with it for JL3. It's in the hands of Wesley Yates. Impact made a nice push there. Mm -hmm. Yates, see what he's got. High. Cut, cuts Robinson. Actually, Robinson got cut off by Everwine there. Now Robinson's going to look to attack. Got fouled. Next up, arguably the game of the day. Next up with uh, Drive Nation and Mass Rivals. Yeah, how do you see that one going down? Uh, I think it's going to be close. Uh, Drive Nation, though, they're, I think they know how good Mass Rivals is. They've been looking at them. Mm -hmm. Don't think they're going to take them lightly. One game a day, they'll come out strong. Put a cap around their opening weekend here. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Well, that'll be right back. Yates all the way, lays it up. What a finish from Wesley Yates. Bucket and got a foul too. What a finish. See if Yates can connect to the line for one more. See if we can hit this one. It is up and good. Fifty-eight forty-two, starting to gain some control here in this fourth quarter is JL three. Patch packaging together buckets and stops. Phelps has it. Turns around. Middle of the floor, trying to go high, low. Everwine taps that one in for two. 58-44, four and a half left. JL3 remains in control. Zayden High catches out high. Fakes the handoff, will drive, scoop layup, wow. got it. So fluid, so smooth. Strong drive, high, rejects that one away again. And it somehow stays with JL3. Couldn't see where it deflected away. Walters kicks out high from beyond NBA range. Went off right. 60 to 44. Passes deflected, saved by Knuckles. Everwine launches a deep one. Missed it short. Rebound, Wesley Yates has the basketball. Yates gives it to Zayden High. Bobbled it a little bit on the catch. But now it's 3.42 left. Hands it off to Walters. Walters looking to create something. Gives it out Brody Robinson from way downtown. Missed it short. Rebound ahead and Knuckles has it. He'll go up, lay it in. 60 to 46.
Yates, three, no. Off the wiring, we'll go the other way. And like we said, probably the game of the day coming up. Drive Nation, top two team in the country preseason. 2-0 on the weekend coming in. They're gonna take on Mass Rivals. See how they do. Drive their layup, no. That's a foul call. Two shots on the way for Everwine. Everwine has two free throws. First one is up. It is good. Second one, up and good. Here's Yates with it. Not Yates, excuse me, Johnson. Pass, I don't know if that got deflected or not. He just turned it over, 60 to 48 to count. Weaving through. All the way around. Everwine launches one from deep. Might have been partially blocked. Oh, what nice underhand rifle head pass. Lob it up. Throw it up. No. And they call a foul. It was on Gunfie. That got fouled. He'll go to the line for two right here. Two twenty-three left. They'll call it on the floor. Strange. Yeah, very strange. I was really confused as to why they were lining up with a baseline out of bounds set. Corner three, Yates. No good. It rattled out. Everwine's got it. Everwine pitches ahead to Knuckles. We'll see what Knuckles can do. And he draws a foul. Here is Everwine, another three. Finally got one to go. Nine point game, two minutes to go. Impact needs to stop. Let's see if they can get one. Chris Johnson, gonna bring it up, guarded by Knuckles. Puts on the Jets, stops in his tracks. Weaving through, all the way, draws a foul. Still called on the floor. Walters is going to come in. What? Sixty to fifty one the count. Pull up Walters, no. Shot clock violation. JL3 coaching staff's not happy. Got some shot clock confusion going on here. Deep three. Knuckles, no. Rebound secured, Yates. 
they foul him. And I think now he'll be shooting a one and one. Timeout called by JL3, they're gonna get it together. For JL3. Here's Walters with it. 60 to 51 the count. Kick out. Hubs gives it in. Or Gums, excuse me, not Hubs. Now Chris Johnson has it. They got about 15 on that shot clock. Taking some time. Here is Walters. See what they can get. Walters, step back, one legged jumper. Had the defender leaning every which way. He missed it though. Now Everwine is fouled. He's in a. Here comes Phelps, forced to give it out. It's Kalen White. Strong drive there, layup, good, they needed it. Timeout called by Texas Impact. Thirty-one point nine on the clock. We are JL three, getting it over. Pitchhead Johnson. They got 22 seconds left in the game and 18 on the shot clock. Yates has it. He'll give it out. Walters almost lost it. 13 seconds. Never called a foul. Yates. And then Zayden High is fouled. He'll have a chance to pad those impressive stats a little bit more here at the line with uh, two free throws, or at least a one and one, with eight seconds left. Yeah, strong opening weekend for JL3. Huh. Probably tired like I am. Um, like we yeah, are. Yeah, yeah, right. First half of the Heat Lightning game kind of woke them up there down by 20 since then. They pr played pretty solid. One more free throw to put a cap around this one. Yep, it is up and good. 62-53. And with under 10 seconds to go, Everwine launches, misses. That'll do it. Now we'll get his stat line before we get off here. Yeah, exactly. Definitely let me know. See what he finished with. But that was an impressive game. 